Hey gorgeous, welcome back to Life and Style. Today's video is going to be my weekly plan with me. I'm going to be planning the week of January 28th uh, through February 3rd in my Erin Condren vertical as I usually do. This week's uh, kit comes from a sticker bloom and it is called Hello Winter. It is absolutely beautifully foiled in silver foil. I have used many of these kits. I have hauled a lot of stuff from them. Sticker Bloom is honestly, for me, one of my favorite sticker companies. Their um, products, their, you know, uh, the way they do their stickers are always, you know, perfect for me. I have absolutely no complaints with them. Um, their shipping is, you know, on point within the time that they say it's going to be, and I just, I love them to pieces, so I absolutely love using any of their kits in my spreads. So like I said, this is called Hello Winter. As you can see, we've got a lot of wintry scenes there, a little penguin, just those icy type of blues and pinks and creams and whites. And again, that silver sparkle really lends itself to that winter vibe. So you have your full boxes, quarter boxes on top, all of your functional script and icons, your Hello Weekend banner, your... Um, habit trackers, hydrate trackers, your heart checklist flags down the line there. And I love the fact that they always give you a lot of functional stuff. So it's always good that, you know, the kits are really full. Then you have a um, almost full sheet of ombre heart checklist boxes with the exception of this one, which is going to be your sidebar weekly. Then some um, quarter boxes up top. Bill dues, you get four of those, some flags, movie marquee, a bunch of um, different... Uh, Quarter boxes just formatted differently. Then you have a bunch of uh, half boxes there at the bottom. And of course, all of the colors coordinate and you have some of the clip art watermarked on some of those half boxes. Then you get these um, quarter boxes here that are just in a different format up top, all of your littles and then all of your headers as well. Then the uh, washi page here, you have your bottom washi, which is beautifully foiled there. It says, hello, winter. And even though we're well into winter now, um, I just hadn't used this kit earlier. So that's going to be your bottom washi, washi strips here, washi strips all up here, and then also some very, very pretty deco um, up here in the corner. And then you have your... Um, glitter header page, which again, I said in the last video, I think I did, is that I really, really would love to see all glitter headers just foiled, even if the rest of the kit is not, because I think it just lends this sparkle, you know, to that, which I think just adds, I think just adds a little something to the spread. So you have your date dots here, which I'm not going to be using those today. I'll show you what I will be using. And then your date covers, which are absolutely gorgeous, as you can see there. And of course, they are foiled. And let's have this camera focus here. It's really acting like an ass right now. There we go. So that's spoiled, which is beautiful. So the date dots that I'm using actually is going to be coming from the kit I used last week. This is from Pink Polka Dot Lily. And because I had these left, I went ahead and I'm going to go ahead and use these. And these are silver foiled, which goes with this kit beautifully. So like I said, it's January 28th through the 3rd. So per usual, I'm going to get started with our date covers and our bottom washi. I think that's always a nice place to start. It kind of helps me to get the rest of the spread in order. So I'm going to go ahead and white out the top of these because I definitely think that with these day covers, these are going to show through. So I'm just going to white these out. And for that, I'm using my Tombow um, correction tape. This is the mini version. So it's just a smaller um, casing, but it's still you know, it still does what it's supposed to do. So, so we are well into winter. And at the time that I am filming this, because I have to take opportunity to film when my son's not here. And especially now in the new place, it's an apartment. So I don't have the downstairs room like I had where I could, you know, go in and kind of close myself off for a little bit and film um, even if he was home, because he knew how to get to me, so that wasn't an issue. Um, but it's not that way now, so I've got to film when I can, and right now he's with my mom. I'm going to be picking him up in a little bit. We have a huge storm coming today. Um, she's actually had him since Thursday afternoon, which was nice. Just gave me a, a little alone time, um, although it wasn't always the best. Um, you know, just getting used to living alone and being on my own now, it's obviously different after being with someone for basically a little over 11 years. Okay, this is not going to work, so let's pull that out there. I don't know what's been the issue with 
white out stuff lately even with the Tombow it's not and I don't know if it's the paper because I see other people doing it and it works well for them so maybe I just don't have that magic touch for white out um, I'm probably gonna have to also white out the bottom so um, so yeah so I'm taking I took the opportunity to film to clean up a little bit to watch some shows to just you know be here be present in my own space so um, it's still, it's going to take a lot of getting used to because like I said, um, being with somebody for over 11 years and then not is a, um, is a rude awakening, but I enjoyed it. I watched some shows. I did some planning on my own, setting up a, um, a TN for myself, the one that I take with me. So that is always super fun. And again, I just relaxed and, you know, just, it was just me time. So I was okay with that. So I'm going to be picking him up in a little while because, like I said, we have a huge storm coming. And this is supposed to really do a number here. Um, I'm in Connecticut. We always joke, of course, because they never... <laughs> they give you the biggest range because they're like, they don't want to be wrong because there's been so many times that they've been wrong. And I know that that's not necessarily a, a true science, even though it seems like it because they're always talking about Dopplers and stuff, but... Mother Nature's going to do what she's going to do, whether you like it or not. So, um, But we want to make sure we're hunkered down. I'm not going to work until Monday afternoon, which is good because it's supposed to freeze over pretty, pretty badly. So we're just going to hunker down and stay in and watch TV and all that good stuff. And he has everything he needs. The only thing I hope is that we don't run out of, um, that we don't have a power outage. That's always the... Um, biggest fear you know because especially it is freaking freezing outside and although I live in an apartment um, building now so I wonder if they have generators I was thinking about that the other day you know before we were in the house although we always got very lucky people even around us would lose power and we'd be absolutely fine so um, we were very lucky uh, about that that we didn't really lose power constantly I think we lost it maybe once if that um, but I'm wondering in, a, in an apartment building with so many people that they wouldn't have some sort of generator ready to kind of rev up if something like that should happen. So we shall see. But I've got everything I need and we're ready for it. And we've been very, very lucky. Um, it's, what, what date are we in? So we're mid to getting towards the end of January. And... Um, this is our first snowstorm, so we're very, very lucky. We've had snow before, but nothing significant. And um, so we were due, you know what I mean? But now I'm worried that the floodgates are open and that the next month and a half is just gonna be freaking snow everywhere. So that's what I'm worried about. All right, so I'm gonna take these date dots from Pink Polka Dot Lily, as I said, and I'm going to use those. So we're gonna be starting on the 28th here. Just put these down. I like these much, much better. And it'll take us through, I think the third, right? Second is Groundhog Day. I don't really trust the little groundhog. He's a cutie patootie, but eh, whatever. Nobody believes you, groundhog. <laughs> what is the name? Pucks, Pucks a Tawny Phil or something? I mean, you know. Oh, wait a minute. Is this? Okay, no, that's right. I am absolutely that person that has to always look to see how many days are in a month. Besides... February, I wouldn't know what days are nothing. Like literally, I have to look every single time. And I don't know that little nursery rhyme song about what September has this. And I don't know what the hell they have. I gotta look at my phone, and that's that. <laughs> so that's where we work with that. These are really, really pretty date dots. So I'm definitely gonna be using these again. All right, so we're gonna put those to the side, and then let's do the bottom washi, which is beautiful. I love that marbling effect. And then you have that beautiful silver sparkle in the foil. It's so, so gorgeous. All right. So just try to get it in the middle. I kind of have given up with trying to layer washi on top of it only because it goes over and I'm just like, eh, I don't feel like see how high or how close okay I'm trying to keep things even <laughs> I 
as even as I can, obviously. But I'm such a perfectionist when it comes to stuff like this, and it's just like, okay, hi, it's only stickers. But then I'm like, yeah, but once it goes down, and if it's wrong, and you have to keep looking at it, it's going to drive me. I'm going to be not happy. So, so there is, how pretty is that, right? So, so pretty. Love it. Okay, so we are now going to work on our full boxes, as I usually do. And I'm going to do the sidebar after. Usually I'll kind of start it, but today I'm not going to um, do that. I'm just going to zoom you out just a pinch. And um, we're going to start with just the, the main spread here. So I think what I am going to do is I am going to put this on the sidebar, though. That is absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to start up here with this pink. And let's see, we'll start from the bottom. I don't know if, if anybody, I'm sure there are people that are like this, but I look at stickers, especially stickers that I'm just so in love with. And I'm just, I just, I like, I'm, I don't know. It's just one of those things that makes me super happy, especially really, really pretty stickers. It's just something that's aesthetically pleasing to me. And especially with foil lately, I've just been like so gaga over it. And I love it. Absolutely love it. I'm just going to close this up. And that's why I say like some of the kits, actually not some, all of the kits that I get from Sticker Bloom because I get them foiled are just, they're one of those companies for me, one of those shops that just, they do it for me in that respect. And I just, I love it. I absolutely love it. Actually, did we start with a pink? We started with a pink. So let's do that first. And it just, it makes me happy to look at a spread so nicely put together and the colors are gorgeous and the sparkle is pretty and everything just looks, just looks gorgeous. And Mr. Little Penguin here, who is so adorable. Love it. And then what was the next one? It was a blue. So let's use this one. See, that's no bueno. No, no bueno. There we go. Don't get funky there. Don't get funky there. All right, I'm going to use the crown. I really like that. So I have an extra. I usually save my extras for like my TNs because those, as you can obviously tell if you watch my channel, I don't film those. And I'll just sit down as a way to relax and kind of just help with my anxiety. I'll plan on my own. And all of this stuff goes into like a leftovers um, portion of a binder and it's it does I love it because then I can just kind of grow with what I've got and use that stuff I don't have to keep dipping into new kits all right so glitter headers I think I want to use this like lighter green here so let's do that yeah okay so they're coming off this way so we're gonna do our little hand glitter holder there. <laughs> Do that. Again, just having foil on glitter headers, especially if they're not real glitter, I think just really elevates the look overall. And even if the entire kit, to me anyway, and I mean, I don't know how hard it is to do, but as a consumer, even if the kit is not foiled, to foil the glitter headers, I think is it just honestly just makes it look so much better. I love it. I want to see sparkle everywhere. I wasn't a really big foil girl, um, and not for any reason other than I think until I really started seeing kits being foiled, and I was just like so in love. And so then after that, it was just like, okay, just foil everything and just give it, give it to me all. I just, I want all of it. <laughs> And if I have the option between a foil and non-foiled non and foiled kit, even if it's a couple bucks extra, I will absolutely get the foiled because, again, it just it makes me happy. And there are the glitter headers. Now we are going to go ahead into our daily headers. So let me just grab that sheet as we do. All right, so we're going to do that across the top with weekdays being today and then weekend being to do. This. The only thing I will say about the um, sticker bloom kits is that I wish 
as you can see here, you've got just all the coloration from the kit, which is nice, but I like my, see right now, that's not gonna, I like my headers to be the same color across. Um, and that's just me. I know not everybody's gonna be the same. Um, it doesn't bother me horrendously that they're not because I just, as you can see, just alternate them here, but um, I like them to be the same color just so that everything's kind of cohesive, you know? So there's that. We need two more. We'll use this one. And which one was the other one? The lighter one. So we'll use that one for there. I'm almost done with emptying out this apartment as far as like all of the bins and boxes that I had to go through to kind of downsize. And I just, I'm like, if I ever, if I never see another bin in my entire freaking life, it'll be too damn soon. I'm just, I'm sick of it. <laughs> all right, so what for Saturday and Sunday, I'm gonna grab the to-do stickers that are the same color. And, cause we only need two, so obviously I can do that. Yeah, so I'm almost done. A lot of these bins are going to my mom's house cause she has a full basement. And so I'm keeping them there the problem I the thing I ran into and that was my own fault is that I was supposed to be bringing stuff to her house before I moved and I didn't do that so of course come moving day all that shit had to come here um and so that was no bueno because let me see what we've got for what do we want to use I'm trying to see what we want to use for the work because they have quarter boxes but they're all different and not that that's a horrible thing mind you but all right so I think what I'm going to do let me see these washi strips I don't know that I want to do washi strips I'm going to do these because I have four of them so I can use them for the four days that I'm working and then Wednesday I can use something different so we'll do that yeah so it's just I still have bins left in my place. Today I'm taking a bunch with me to her house so that they're out of here. But then even after that, I still have a lot left. So I'm just like, girl, <laughs> I just like, no more, please, no mas. And so I just, I wanna get this place completely emptied, completely organized. And I did better than I think people thought I was going to do. But the thing is, and I told people, I said, I don't wanna be doing this a month after I move. I don't wanna still be going through things a month after I move. I don't wanna worry about taking a bin here, or taking a bin there. I just wanna be done, you know? And so that's kind of where I'm at with that. So what do we have for flags? They're kind of long. I don't know that I wanna use, I may cut them, okay. So for Wednesday, since I am off, I'm going to use something different. Let's see what I have here. I guess I could use one of these. I'm going to use one of these here. I'm going to use the pink. And then I'll just, actually, I'll just put it up. Uh, I'll put it in the middle so it can have some sort of evenness to it, I suppose. All right, so there's that. And I'm looking at my paper. You guys know I always write down what I'm going to be doing for the week. And I've got, I'm starting spin class again on the 28th, so I'm super excited. And I'm going Wednesday morning, Saturday, and Sunday. So, <laughs> so excited, so excited. Like, really, really excited. You have no idea. So, I'm going to put that as extras down here because I wouldn't necessarily use these for anything else, but it's going to help me cover up this stuff. So, not Tuesday because my mom has. I have to get my son at a certain time, but I can go, well, actually Wednesday morning is when I'm going to go because I'm off. So we're going to do that, what, for 9 a.m.? So we'll do that. And let's see how I'm going to, I'm trying to see what box I'm going to use for that. So extra, so what, I'm going four times that week. I don't know that I want to use, what are these? Hmm. Oh, there we go. Can you see? All right, so I'm gonna take this one for that. Actually, you know what? I'm not. I lie to you because I want to be able to write down what time the class is, and I'm gonna need more space than just that. So for the gym, I think I am gonna use a half box because I want to write in 
um, what we're going to be doing or what, what class I'm going to be doing. So I want to use boxes with a little bit of decoration on it just to kind of zhuzh it up. And I'm not going to put a header here because I already have the today header there. And I'll put this one up there. That's for Wednesday morning. And I'm sorry, my nails are a complete, absolute, just disaster. I just, I haven't gotten around to doing them. I am going to do them in the next day or two. It's just, since I'm still doing so much, it just seems like so counterproductive because I know that my nails are going to get busted the hell up. You know what I mean? So what did I say? Monday, Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday. So that's what we're going to do. So Saturday and Sunday are going to be in the mornings. So we will do that. Again, I want to use half boxes that have some design on them. There we go. And then we'll use this one. It's very, very pretty. I'm loving this kit so far. It's so beautiful. Okay, so there we have that. And then we always do like our housework and stuff on Saturdays and Sundays. So I'm just trying to figure out if I want to... See, I always like to use... <clears throat> I like to use my icons, but because I have so many things to do, I may not do that. All right, so let's go ahead and do two pinks, same coloring. And then what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna bring this let me see, would this fit with the... Oh, it does. Okay, good. Because I'm like, I need a header, but I want to make sure this is going <clears> to, <throat> excuse me, fit completely. That's good. And that's good. Okay. So, do we want to do another to-do or... Ah, to clean, we can use that for Saturday because that is going to be, that's usually the day I tend to do the cleaning. I don't like doing a lot on Sunday except relaxing. I like it to be kind of a fluid type of day. Um, and actually what we're gonna do is we're gonna use next week for this. I keep forgetting that lately I've been trying to use my Sundays for that or the Sunday, like that bottom portion to plan for next week so I kind of know what's coming up. And we'll see what we're going to put there, but I'm sure I'm going to put something else there. So let's see what other quarter box I have. Actually, let's see if this fits here because that may fit there. So we'll do that because that will be for me to upload. If I can get the darn sticker. Um, to upload my plan with me, my weekly plan with me. So there's that for that. All right, so cleaning, spin, I have it for those days. And day off. I also have, all right, so let's do this. I'm going to back up a bit. Let's start putting down the scripts for working day off and all that good stuff. So I have, just trying to get myself organized here a little bit. So I have this, because a girl wants to use stuff, damn it. <laughs> so I have these two sheets, right? So I have this one from Paper Muse Crafts that has the little laptops, and I love to be able to use these for work, right? And then I have this Planning World Foiled Functional Worksheet that, as you can see, I've love and I've used this before on plan in plan with me's so I could do this and not necessarily have to write the word work in the word work in right um and I could start trying to finish this off so I think I'm going to do that sorry paper muse crafts I will use you eventually <clears throat> excuse me so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with the laptop and it'll just stay there. I don't have to write anything in. And then I'm going to do the printer. Then I'm off on Wednesday, so let's move on to Thursday and Friday. And then I am going to use, it's like a stack of paper. 
I haven't used any of those yet, so we're gonna do that. And then we'll use one of these desks, which I love, love, love this. I don't know if this camera's gonna focus very well on this. I'm hoping it does so you can see the sticker. Probably, there we go. I don't know if you could see. I love that. It's so dainty and still so full of detail on that sticker. Okay, so work is done. Sorry, Paper Muse Crafts. <laughs> we'll put you on the side over here because we're done with that. I see my Gym Time stickers, so I'm going to use those. These are from Nicole Alexia Design, uh, clear with silver foil. So I'm going to use those for when I'm going to the gym. And I'm going to put that at the bottom here. Hold on a second. Let me take that in the middle. I think that's going to be better if I do it that way at the bottom. And then I'll write in the class and the time. These are beautiful and I only have one of these in silver and I think one in rose gold. I'm definitely going to be, have to order some more of these. These are really, really pretty. So down in the middle, that looks so pretty. And then Saturday and Sunday. So let's do that. I just noticed how quiet it got. I have my heat on like auto, so it'll turn on when it gets below the designated temperature so you'll probably hear it and be like what the hell is that noise it's my heater people it's cold over here <laughs> oh so cold it's just although i'll tell you i'd rather deal with the cold every single day for the three months or three and a half months that we have winter here in connecticut than any snow at any given time i just i don't like snow i don't know a lot of people who do so let's put it that way all right so wednesday Actually, now I'm wondering if I should grab another different day off sticker. Eh, let's do what we've got, because we do have, do, yeah, we kind of do have black there. Um, I'm going to be grabbing, actually, I'm going to put that over there. I'm going to be grabbing my two sheets from Sarah Elizabeth Prince, as you can see. I've used these a lot. And then these appointment script boxes. I love them because the word appointment is there, but it's part of the actual box. So I love to use these. I have day off stickers that are silver foiled, but... And I have to go get them. So we will do what we have here. We'll use what we have here. And the script is gorgeous. So it's I have absolutely no issue with using that. So there's the day off. And actually Wednesday I have an appointment after my spin class. So I'm going to put that kind of down here so that I can put a header. So these sheets are done. I love putting sheets to the side because I'm like, okay, now I can kind of see a little better what I have in front of me. So let me grab, let me see. And we'll just put extras down. Is that the darker pink? So we'll do that just to fill that. And I always say this, I'd rather use the headers in the kit than the glitter headers for me, unless they're over full boxes for the most part. And this is just me, I know everybody's different. It's just a waste for the way I think. Um, all right, so. Let's see, do I have that out? I'm just looking at all the scripts that I have to do. So for um, Monday, I wanna do an Instagram post and on Wednesday, I wanna do an Instagram post. As I said in my last plan with me, I'm trying to get better with that so that I can be a little more visible on social media. So I want to, I like these very much. Are they, these are, yeah, so these are headers, but they've got the design on them, which I think is so beautiful. And Monday, I'll know that the Instagram post that I do want to do is my plan with me spread. And then on Wednesday, is going to be Washi Wednesday. And I love Washi Wednesdays. I really do, again, I just really need to get into the habit of doing those things because I think it's awesome to share. And I love personally seeing other people's things. And I just got to get with the times. So I'll do Instagram post right on there. And this is a sheet from Saucy Stickers Co. Um, as you can see, I've already used some. I only have one of these, so I'm going to have to order several more um, sooner rather than later if I'm going to be using these every week. So there's that Instagram post for Washi Wednesday. We're done with that. So away you go. And then... Can I do it that day? I'm wondering if I have time to do it without my son grocery shopping. 
I probably don't because that's nine. No, I lied. I do have time to do grocery shopping before my appointment, so let's put that down. I'm grabbing another sheet from Saucy Sticker uh, Stickers Co. Grocery shopping. These are really, really nice. I love the script. And again, I always say this, but even though they're just black, no foil, it doesn't matter. I think they're perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the same header and that way. cohesive with that and grocery shopping so right there all right so Wednesday's pretty well done so Tuesday is really boring I'm just working I'm not doing much and I get home late anyway so it's not like I'm running around looking for things to do you know um, I don't know I don't know. Maybe we'll go back. We'll go back to that. And even if it's something just for me, I'll put that down. So, Jesus, Wednesday is jacked up and I have some other stuff there, but that's, well, it's not something I necessarily need to write down. I know what's going on there. So, let's say Thursday I've got a bill due. And I put it on for last week, which was rent, because that's the day I get paid. Do we have any builders? We do. <clears throat> but it's just more or less a reminder for me to not spend money. <laughs> and so I'm going to put the bill due here, because this is when the bill is really due. That's kind of, that, kind of like a snooze button, if you will. So that's for rent. And then on the bottom here, Friday, Thursday... I want to vacuum. Actually, Wednesday, I want to vacuum, but I'm going to put it down on Thursday. I have no more space on Wednesday, for the love of God. <laughs> and then Friday is just really relaxation. There's nothing, there's nothing really for me to do. Um, actually, my mom will have him this week, weekend. So that's going to work. So Friday... Maybe I'll get together with some girlfriends for dinner. I haven't done anything since I moved, and with being so busy and just emotionally, eh, you know, kind of, eh. All right, so let's do that. So let's do, uh, let's see, what else? Let's do extras. So we'll do that. Put that down there. And then I'll get in touch with some girlfriends and see if they want to go out to dinner. So we do that. Let me see if I have a quick... functional icon for that. Hmm. Not really. I'm going to be going out right after work, so that's okay. All right, so there's nothing really, right? Date night, eh. I'm going to call it date night. <laughs> it's not really date night, but that's okay. What I'll do is I'll put one of these little bows corner here. Just as a special little touch. Okay, and Thursday, what did I say for Thursday? Nothing really, because... I'm going to be getting home kind of late, as I usually do, so it doesn't matter. Did I put grocery shopping down? I did, so that can go away. Cleaning time, I have a couple more stickers here for Saturday. But do I even want to waste that? Probably not. I'm not going to waste that um, because I can just write down what I have or what I need to do. And Thursday. I want to do my nails, but that's... I don't know. Let's try. I'll try to do my nails on Thursday. And we'll see what we'll, what we'll do. If I come home and just do everything super quickly, I can sit down within an hour or so and get my nails done. Especially if I'm going to go out. On Friday, I don't want my nails to look bust it so I'm just gonna grab a flag actually I'm gonna grab well let me see how big this is yeah that's fine I'm gonna grab the 
marble flag. It's just a smaller flag. And what I was going to grab earlier, we'll put that there. And then the nails stickers are from Katie's Sticker Company, which I think are, again, so simple, but so perfect. So what I did is I just put a little heart sticker there because I just felt that this um, functional icon with the nail polish is just going to be a little too much there. So that's fine. I have absolutely no, excuse me, no issue with that. So let's go ahead and start working on the sidebar since I'm not sure what we're doing on Tuesday yet. Um, I'm not going to wipe that the box out. I rarely do, but here we go with the stupid whiteout again. <laughs> Oh, I swear it's just anybody that can make a whiteout that just behaves would be so a hero in the planning world. All right, let's see what we can do here. So just going to go ahead and start whiting this out and have faith that it's going to work. I try to do it slowly. I think if you do it too fast is when it starts kind of rolling around and stuff. So I've been kind of um, experimenting, if you will, with it. So we'll see what happens. But as long as it works and it's whited out, that's all I care about. Also, this week, I'm going to start planning my dinners again, especially since I'm going to be starting my workouts. I want to make sure that I'm on point on both fronts, both exercise and food, because I have not been eating well at all. Just, you know, stress eating and all that stuff. And um, I know that it's time that I, I stop that. Actually, you know what? I am going to wipe this out because this box, I don't want this black to show through the silver outline. So let me try to... Get this off as best I can. And then we can take it from there. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna grab this one that says winter. It's so beautiful. And we're gonna go ahead and get started with that one. Put it right there. And of course it's already uneven, but whatever. <laughs> it is what it is. So for washi, I actually grabbed a roll that I had purchased, I want to say at Hobby Lobby. It was part of a um, set, like four or five of them for uh, winter. And this has silver snowflakes. I'm not sure how well this camera is going to focus, especially with that in the background, but that's what it looks like. And so I wanted to keep it kind of um, cool and icy instead of doing bows. Okay, now I completely lost where this thing opens at. Or starts at so I wanted to keep things icy and I really do like this um, washi and I've used this before so we're gonna use this one yeah that looks really nice I like that okay so we're gonna grab the ruler and the slice tool as we usually do to make sure we get a nice even cut and measuring this you know one day soon one day soon, I will get an even sidebar. I don't know how people do that. I see people do that and I'm just like, how the hell do you do that? I need your secrets. I need your trade secrets. All right, so the full box, we have one left. Let me grab, <sighs> okay, and my sidebar weekly because we are gonna be doing dinners this week. So I wanna make sure I am on top of that and We use this sidebar weekly, maybe, there we go. And like I said, I wanna stay accountable on both fronts, both exercise and dinners. What I've been doing with my habit tracker is using that for snacks, um, basically to keep track of no snacks. And I'm just gonna zoom you in a bit because I've been, again, not only just eating not well, but also snacking horrendously and I can't even like I can't even explain how badly. And I know that in my mind, it's because of everything that's been going on, but you know, I've also been telling myself that it's time to, you know, not everybody's gonna internalize things differently or react to everything 
I mean, and not everybody's going to internalize things the same or react to things the same way. And that's the beauty of being human and individual. <clears throat> but I keep telling myself it's, it's time to just stop. You know, you need to start taking care of yourself, both health wise, emotionally, mentally, physically, all this stuff. So I've been, you know, I've been doing that. Um, this week. So I use this week for the habit tracker. And I may have it track the workouts as well, but we'll see. And I'll grab the light pink. Actually, let's grab the dark pink, all right? Because that matches with the one. Ah, it doesn't matter. It's all the same. I mean, it's all the same coloration for the kits, right? So it doesn't really matter. All right, so that's for snacks, or lack thereof, if you will. No snacking. And then some more washi. I love, love, love this washi. The silver on that is just so beautiful and perfect. It's so funny, I'm looking down at the rug and my dog is just staring at me like, Mama, what are you doing? What are you doing? Who are you talking to, Mama? <laughs> and it's probably like, this bitch is cray cray. <laughs> He's such a little, little punk. All right, so workouts. Do that. Keep track of that. And again, it's a good way to fill the space, of course, especially when your washi is very thin. You've got a lot of space there. And oh, where's I was about to put the washi down, and I'm like, mm, you need the habit tracker, girlfriend. <laughs> so that one is the darker pink. And we'll use that for that. Another thing of washi. Maybe. This to myself all the time. <laughs> Maybe the other direction. Oh my gosh, I literally, I do this, there we go. <laughs> do this to myself all the time. But I think, I think we all do. Right? In the planning world, we lose sight of where we, where the washi starts. <laughs> Let that go down. Yeah, okay. There we go. I swear the slice tool is life. It is everything. I love using this thing. I had to get a few more too, but they're not very expensive. They're available on Amazon. That's where I got mine. And I think that's where most people get theirs. Um, so actually not too bad with the rolling over to the side there. All right. So let's see what else we have to fill up at the bottom there. What I did last week was put a half box and then put kind of a personal um, positive quote let me see if I can do that again this week and how well that's going to... Yeah, I think that's going to fit beautifully. So I'm going to do the light green to kind of match the... The, um, the habit tracker. And I think that that will cover up the rest of the whited out portion. So there's the sidebar weekly. And I think that that works really, really well. So I'll write in a positive quote there. Tuesday, still not sure what the hell we're going to be doing. And I hate, again, to use a... Um, I'd hate to use a glitter header just for the point of using the glitter header. So let's see if I have... See, I do have this. It's like the... But then what are we going to do with that? do this is like a, a blank day cover they always put one in their kit so I'll do that just again to fill in that green is there any other greens no okay so we'll use that to fill in the green and then we'll put some deco so I think we're at the point let me just see what I've got here Yeah, so Saturday I do want to film. So why don't we put down... Okay, hold your horses there. <laughs> why don't we put down a flag instead of a box across? Actually, I think we'll use this one right here because it's thin enough and it'll fit. So we'll put that there. And then the film 
script that I'm going to be using is coming from a sheet from Planning Roses, as you can see there. Maybe if the stupid camera focus, film, edit, upload all across the way. So I'm just going to grab film. And I'll put that there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, and I'll write in. And then here we're going to be uploading. I'm probably editing and uploading, but do I want to put both there? Yeah, I don't know how that's going to look. We hardly have a chance to use edit, you know what I mean? Oh, let me do it. It's my planner, do what I want. <laughs> so edit there, and then we're gonna grab upload. Hopefully that'll fit, and that's fine. All right, perfect. Okay, so that works. So let me go ahead and write in everything that I need to write in off camera as I normally do, and I'll come back so we can finish up. So that is everything written into this week's spread loving it. I know I probably say that every single week. I love this damn kit. Love it. I love the coloring of it. It's just, and the way I think I placed everything down, you get, you know, your pinks and your blues and your creams and the marble just spread out for me anyway, very, very beautifully. And of course, with that silver foil, I mean, how gorgeous is that, right? Absolutely beautiful and just so winter appropriate for me. I love silver in the winter. The pen that I did use to write in everything is the Pigma Micron 03. It's just in black um, and it is a 0 0.35 millimeter line. So I don't think you're going to be able to see it, but it's quite, quite thin. Um, and I do very much love the way this writes. I didn't want to use blue ink for this spread. I definitely wanted to use black. So I decided to use my Micron 03. Um, I did my dinners for the week, the no snacks, um, habit tracker and then my private personal positive message for this week was be strong and so like I said everything else is written in all the cleaning stuff all the things for next week um, my appointments and all that good stuff very much looking forward to this week because again this is when I get my ass back into the gym and I am determined to go four to five times a week we're starting out with four I am going to feel like um, absolute death after probably one or two classes um, although I do like spin but I haven't been in very very long time but I'm ready I'm ready to go forward and get healthy and do me and work on me and just I feel really 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 good about this week so thank you so much per usual for spending some time with me um, with this plan with me I always appreciate that you watch my videos and like the content that I put out there if you haven't done so already please subscribe to the channel and also click that little bell so you get alerted as to whenever I upload new content if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up and I will see you in the next one bye